Hallo kijkers van Shine Surprise, welkom bij een nieuwe aflevering van Latest Mystery Journey. In de vorige aflevering zijn wij aan een nieuwe case begonnen en het schijnt hier te spoken in dit huis. En we moeten nu met Butler Wooster gaan praten uh, of hij misschien weet waar het vandaan komt. Gosh, ghost, it's rather scary, isn't it? You mean you don't, Cheryl? Of course not, it's all just some big misunderstanding. May I? I would appear I startled you, sir. My apologies. Yeah, and you should apologize to others too. <laughs> Lol. One an what an exceptional can canine, canine you keep, ma'am. Uh, one discerns an almost intelligent stone of in her bark. Thank you, Wooster. In fact, we were hoping uh, to speak to you about what's been happening here in the house. Indeed, ma'am, it's uh, to be understood that you have accepted Mrs. Rice's request then. Very good. I shall endeavor uh, to answer any questions you care to ask. Lisa tells us that you've been uh, experiencing a lot of ghostly f visitations recently. Is that right? And that's correct, ma'am. Phenomena of the uh, supernatural are uh, to be observed here with some regularity. Um, since the late, mi since the late Mr. Wright passed away, that is. It's my understanding that rather uh, unfortunate moniker of the Six White House on horrors has been adopted by local residents. Hmm, that's unfortunate. The Six White House hauntings has more of a mysterious ring to it, don't you think? Tell me, Wooster. Um, have you witnessed any of these strange happenings yourselves? Indeed, sir. I've, be I've seen ghosts of which Mrs. Wright speaks. Most spine-chilling experience. Uh, at, at first it was six occurrences. Okay, An incident that has come to refer to as the ghost in the garden. Tell us more. Very good, ma'am. One evening I was performing my uh, usual duties, patrolling the grounds uh, that surround the property. As I was walking through the garden, I heard a uh, peculiar noise, somewhat like a muffed voice. Compelled to investigate, I approached the source of the sound. To my surprise, I observed a great number of ghostly forms in the corner of the garden, jostling and uh, whithing together. I say. Um, discombobulated, I nevertheless had the presence of mind to retire before the apparitions became aware of my presence. Regrettably, however, I stumped upon a small shrub that was uh, bound to exclaim. Uh, unsurprisingly, the ghost heard my outcry. They turned the face to me and uh, the great malice in their eyes made an utterance trustily. Okay. <coughs> That's the tale of the ghost in the garden, ma'am. You know, certainly uh, tell it fairly vividly, Wooster. And you say there are six such tales? Indeed, that's uh, which I have just relayed to you, and five others, uh, of equally disturbing nature. Oh yeah. I'm told. I trust you will uncover them all. Uh, we most certainly will, don't you worry. Don't you worry, don't you worry, butler. <laughs> that butler is too creepy for words. Could you hear what he was saying, Emiliana? You are standing all a long way back. Of course I could. Now tell me, how exactly are you planning to get on getting details of the other five tales? By asking people. Let's see if there are any locals nearby who can give us some information. It sounds like the wonderful haunted house is something of a local attraction. Alora, can we leave? It, uh, I agree. It would be a good idea to find some witnesses who don't actually live here. Okay. Je bent gewoon pittig bang voor jou. Brr, this house gives me the creeps. It's funny. I would never have uh, said you were the type of to believe in ghosts, Emiliana. A good profiler must always interpret data with an open mind, allowing your personal beliefs that ghosts cannot possibly exist to cloud your judgments is an elementary and fatal mistake. Oh, 
Oh, hello, miss. Uh, let me see. Ah, yes, Miss Layton and Emiliana. Good evening. What are you doing here, DC Booker? Hmm, according to my notes, the owner of this house, uh, ah yes, here it is, a uh, Mrs. Wright has asked Scotland Yard for help. Uh, she has been the target of some rather grisly supernatural going on, goings on, uh, and wonders if, ah yes, she wonders if it could be the work of pranksters um, investigating. Mm, Lisa did uh, tell us she, she'd enlisted the help of the police already, didn't she? So Detective Constable. Um, how is the investigation going? Mm, the details are all here somewhere. Inspector Hastings was on the case, but was called away unexpectedly. Really? I wonder what for. He asked me to, uh, let me see, ah oh, yes, to take over the investigation. So, um, I'm taking over the investigation. However, well, I did spot a rather suspicious looking shadow at the window before. And it was your job to look out for some special looking things, you know. Oh yes, miss. Um, I'm sure I noted it down. My observations are here somewhere. Here we are. My uh, investigations at the ground... Uh -huh. I was investigating the grounds of the house by myself on, uh, late one night. Okay. Something made me look up for some reason and I saw a shady looking shadow at one of the mansion's windows. All shadows are shady, constable, but surely uh, it was somebody standing at the window, wasn't it? Mm, oh yes, uh, it was much bigger than a person though, uh, and it was it just disappeared, poof, like that. Hmm, well that certainly sounds like a supernatural phenomenon. After asking uh, some local residents, I uh, discovered it's been, um, it's been seen before, okay? People all around call it the wrath at the window. I'm afraid that's, um, let me check me out, ah yes, that's all I know. The wrath at the window, presumably that counts as one of the other six mysterious happenings. Yes, I think so Ernest, well then, that must, uh, that's one more of the list. Nog vier verhalen te zoeken. Let's ask around if anybody knows anything about the six right house horrors, shall we? It seems they are quite famous and immediate neighborhood at last. At least. Perhaps I doubt we find many people on the streets at this time of night. My Riddleton is on stage. Dearie me, there you are. I've been ever so worried about you, you know. I presume you know all about the strange occurrences at the right residence. Oh yes, yes I do. I make it my business too. Of course, I didn't want to say anything before because I didn't want to scare you. But people say that the house is haunted. Uh, that's been uh, cursed the past years. Mm, that makes it sound like it's a relatively recent thing. Well, all the rooms started after the old Mr. Wright passed away, you see. Um, I heard it from a friend first of all, and she heard it from one of her other friends. A friend of a friend? Hmm, hardly the most convincing of sources, but continue. Well, she was invited by Mrs. Wright apparently, uh, very late at night it was. She was shown into the living room and just waiting for Mr. Uh, Mrs. Wright when a puppet was on display there started moving all on its own. No one was touching it and holding it or anything. It just moved. And then just when she thought it was over, she uh, accursed thing's eyes shut open. Ooh. And it started to crackle. Crackle, would you believe? Oh no. I'm surely you don't. Well, my friend's friend was obviously quite beside herself. She didn't bother making her excuses, she just fled. Fled right off, um, right out of the house, she did. Oh, it's a chilling tale, isn't it? It's one of the so-called six white house horrors, you know. The possessed puppet, people call it. You've been very helpful, thank you. Terrifying, but helpful. Oh well, I don't like to gossip, but you do it the whole day. Nice. So, the possessed puppet, that's another tale under our belts. They seem to be something of an urban legend around here. Uh, let's keep going and see what we can find out. Hmm, there aren't uh, very 
uh, many people about at its work uh, out this hour at to ask. Yes, I can't even speak. No, it's rather different. Oh, how about the pet iguana there? Actually, Lisa said it was Madame Dubly who uh, recommended me to her, didn't she? I think that calls for a visit. We must go and thank her at once. To fix it. This Madame Dublis house, what an impressive villa. Shall we go in then? Not yet, let's ask some questions of people on the street first. Good idea, somebody might be able to tell us something useful about the right residents. Ooh, there's a veel. I see here a doggo. Oh, I think this is, isn't that Cheryl's pal over there? That yappy dog we met on the hunt for Rex? You're right, Pinstripe. It looked like uh, this is his territory too. Well, in that case, he's bound to know Lisa's house. Go and ask him, Cheryl. See if he's heard of the six right house horrors. Go on, boy. Hi there, Hunt. Didn't expect to see you around here. Oh, it's you, Hound. Still got muzzled to the grindstone with that old sleuthing work, eh? Ever seen anything weird? Um, what have we got investigating now? I feel for you, Hound. I feel for you. Oh, so a ghost. That eh? well, have you ever heard the tale of the sealed cellar? No, that's a new one for me. What's uh, the story? They said that the old house has a cellar, and sometimes ghosts show up there. Uh, that's the kind of low down you were uh, looking for, Hound. Yeah, thanks. I owe you a treat. So according to my sources uh, on the street, apparently there's a tale about the cellar in the right residence. The uh, sealed cellar, he called it. The sealed cellar, that sounds like another of the six tales. Good boy, Cheryl. Golly, a cellular ghost? A cellar with ghosts? Sorry. Uh, I don't like the sound of that. Uh, there must be something dangerous hidden down there. Mm. Excuse me, what are you trying to keep from me? I can hear you're all muttering, you know. We've just learned about uh, another of the six right house horrors. The sealed cellar, apparently. Ah, where did you hear that? Who told you? I'm afraid I can't divulge that information, Emiliana. It's sort of a trade secret, you see? Hmm, Baben. Obviously, your private detectives have sources with uh, legitimate law keepers wouldn't consider using. Je bent een vuile bitte. Oh, a puzzel van die vermoeide man. Hey, the night is ripe, ripe for puzzle solving. Am I right? If the puzzle is interesting enough, it happily solve it at any time. Yes, make sure you. I'm sure you would. You obviously have puzzles on your skin already. Well, it's your lucky night. Geheime puzzle. Geheime puzzle. Level up. A group of monsters has appeared. Oh, nay. Uh, defeat all of the monsters and level up all uh, three of the heroes to level 5. Ah, um, that is from level 5. From the level 5 from Mark. This is now one. Uh, they each need a different number of experience points to level up. Blue le needs 5, yellow needs 10 and red needs 15. Slide the heroes on top of the enemies to attack it. Oh, to attack. It's also possible to undo a move by touching the attacked enemy and uh, let the battle commence. Okay. No. Ah, het is gewoon een soort van tel dingetje. Dan ga ik heel even jullie laten doen. Kijk, deze kan zo level 5 worden. 
Oh, nu ben ik level 6. Oh, dan moet je dan nog 5 omhoog. Oké, okay, oké, okay, oké, okay, oké. Okay. Die heeft 20 punten nodig. Deze heeft 40 punten nodig. Deze heeft 60 punten nodig. Even kijken, hoe gaan we 30 maken? Deze heeft 40 punten nodig. Deze heeft 20 punten nodig. En deze heeft 60 punten nodig. Weet je wat we kunnen doen? We kunnen ook mee mogen. 30 plus 25 is 55. Uh, plus 15 is 70. 87. 88. 96. 98. Uh, 105. 108. 120. Dus. 120 zijn, de, zijn zij in totaal. En hij heeft uh, 20 punten nodig om level 5 te worden. Uh, hij heeft 40 punten om, om level 5 te worden. En deze is, dus het moet precies kunnen. Dat is, daar zijn we nu over uit. Dus je moet exact de Mundo moet je ze, uh, moet je ze de, de dingen geven. Lekker. Het duurt even, wat langer, maar dat is niet erg. We hebben hem nu gehaald. <laughs> well, was it as satisfying as it promised to be? Of course, I always enjoy a good puzzle. <laughs> yes, you do. 
and with you. Oh, hello, miss. Um, good evening. Is Madame Dublé at home? Of course, miss. Madame and Rex are both here. They'll be delighted to see you, I'm sure. Just before that, we're trying to find about, uh, uh, out about the six White House horrors. Oh, yes, only too well. There's a story people call the Morbid Mirror. From the Wright's place, you know. The morbid Mirror? That's right, miss. Uh, they say in a cellar beneath the property there's an old mirror. And when you look in it, you see an ugly twisted face. Just to be clear, we're not talking about someone who's ugly twisted face looking in the mirror, are we? Oh no, miss. It's uh, not your own reflection, you see. It's someone else. Obviously, it's just a story. I don't know if there's any truth in it. Anyway, I'm sure uh, Madam wouldn't like me to keep you. Oh, look, miss, all cat para. Panelia has been replaced with iguani trinkets. That is fine. That is wel leuk. Nou, madam. Jij weet vast nog wel zo'n zo story. Good evening, madam. I'm sorry uh, to drop in at uh, you unannounced like this. Catriel, darling. Oh, I'm delighted to see you. And so is Rexy Waxy, of course. Just look at him. Is that a delighted iguana, Emiliana? Hmm, a profiler and an analyst for of human behavior, Catriel. Iguanas are not my thing. Oh, I believe I've met before, haven't we? Yes, it was at the Save Loy, uh, I'm, if I'm not mistaken. Mm, that's right, yes, and thank you again for your cooperation in that case. Not at all, no. Tell me, what brings you here? Actually, we're investigating the so-called six white uh, house horrors for Lisa White. Oh yes, uh, of course. It was I who gave Lisa your details. And do you know anything about the strange happenings at the White uh, residence? One hears tales. Yes, I remember one in particular. The searched soul, a searching soul. It's called. Burrs souls now. Yes, the story tells uh, a most petrifying spirit that wanders the corridors of uh, that stately old house. Night after night it stalks its prey, st uh, striking terror into the hearts of any visitors unfortunate enough to encounter it. Well, the searching soul is certainly blood-curdling tale, uh, madam. Poor Lisa, she, all, uh, she was always a rather quiet young girl, but ever since her mother and father passed away she seemed rather in the Doldums. Okay. I hope uh, you'll help her. We gaan het proberen, madam. Well, I think now uh, we know the six White House uh, stories, don't we? Yes, the ghost in the garden, uh, the wraith at the uh, the wrath at the window, the proposed puppet, the possessed puppet. Sorry, uh, the sealed cellar, the morbid mirror, and the searching soul. Now, let's return to the house and determine whether there's any truth uh, in these suspiciously alternative tales. Ik wil jullie bedanken voor het kijken van deze aflevering. Vond je het een leuke aflevering? Doe een duimpje omhoog. Zie je graag de volgende keer weer. Adios, amigos.